All right, let's take a look at this equation. This kind of goes back to the stuff we were talking about yesterday. If I have e to the 5x equal to 75, when you have any kind of equation, you have to pay attention to where your x is, and you have to figure out how do I get x in a position that is useful to me? How do I get it back to something that I'm comfortable working with? That's what it is. You, you may think that everything is brand new, but it's really not. It's really about how do we rewrite back to something that we know. Right now, my x, my variable, is in the exponent, and I don't like that. How did I get it out of the exponent yesterday? A common base. Well, but these guys don't really have a common base. E and 75 don't have a common base. So when they don't have a common base, that's when I take the log of both sides. Now, I could just do regular log, like the common log. If I say common log, that means log with base what? 10. But I think the natural log might be better for me here because my base is E. And what is the base for the natural log? E. So if I do the natural log of E to the 5x is equal to the natural log of 75. Doesn't the 5x come down in front of the... Not only will the 5x come down in front, but what we need to understand is that this goes back to the properties we have with <coughs> inverses. So what I have here on the left side is just straight up 5x. You may be looking at this going, why Why is that? Well, Because you assume the E is there, so the E's cancel each other out. Right, because the natural log of E to the 5x means the, nat whoops, means the log, log e of e. with base E of E to the 5x. And just like we saw in your test, when the base of the log is the same as the base inside the log, then the answer is just the exponent 5x. Now, it also would have worked out the same had you written the 5x out in front and said 5x natural log of e. But what is the natural log of e? No, no. If I say the natural log of e, that means log with base e of e, and that equals 1. Remember, this expression means e to the what power equals e? e to the first is equal to e. Well, now that I have 5x equals natural log of 75, how do I finish that? Divide both sides by 5, so what does x equal? Natural log of 75 divided by 5. Now, that's the exact answer. Can I do 75 divided by 5 in this problem? Can I do that? No. no. You better not. What you can do, though, is just type this into your equation. So this is, or type it into your calculator. This is exact. <coughs> Excuse me. And this is your approximation. Now, I know that we've run into issues here before with my math lab about how many decimal places do you round? Do you go up to four? Do you round to the nearest thousandth? <coughs> I'm going to say you round to the nearest thousandth, so that means three decimal places. So point eight six three. And again, we can check this because if we say <coughs> e raised to the five times point eight six three. I should get an answer that's close to 75. It gives me 74.8, so I know that I'm in the right neighborhood. Of course, had I written more of this information from the graphing calculator, my answer would have been more, more precise. Questions about that one? 